Hello everyone. I will be making coconut oil at all. Just select good and matured coconuts. Break it. Extract the water. It can be drunk. Then remove the flesh from the back of the coconut. After removing the flesh, you wash it, making sure all particles are removed. Then you can break the coconut into smaller pieces by cutting it like this to help the blender. Now pour it into the blender cup. I'm going to be using very hot water so that it will help in extracting the oil enough. Blend until very smooth. Now take your cheesecloth and pour the coconut that has been blended with the hot water. Press out as much milk from the blended coconut as possible. Now I'm going to be blending it the second time so that I will get the most of the milk. After that, extract it by using your hand. You can use other method also to press the milk out of the cheese cloth. This is the coconut shaft which can be used for other things in cooking. Now I'm going to keep it in the freezer for about 8 hours so that the coconut milk will solidify. This will help it to get the best from the oil. After that, place in a pot. Remove that uh, scale of coconut milk that are solidified. Place it in the pot and put it on the fire so that it will boil. We are going to be patient at this time because it takes time. Boil over very low heat. You can stir so that it will not stick so much, but there's no how you do it that it will not stick to the bottom of the pot. Continue to boil, to cook, until the oil will start rising on top of the scum or that down part. Please remember to subscribe to my channel as you are watching. God bless you. Can you see the oil? When you are sure the oil is okay, you use a fine sieve to strain it out. That damp part, there's still a lot of oil in it, so you can press it out so that most of the oil will be drained out. That's the oil from three coconuts. I'm going to put a fine net before I will put it in my bottle so that if there's any particle, the net will catch it for me. I have my coconut oil. This coconut oil is very good for the air, for our skin, and if you have it in large quantity, you can use it to cook. Will you try it? If you have watched to this level, I really appreciate. Thanks for watching. Don't forget to subscribe, like, and press the notification bell. Remember, whatever you are passing through, God can see you through. Bye-bye.